a bright ghost to plop uh, uh, For the adventures of bright ghost to plop well, 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 I made it to Lake Mont Park today. Kind of a random little entrance considering they have the entrance kiosk over there. But we'll go through the fence and let's go see what there is to do here today. That's kind of cool. They have like a whole like mini golf course out here with that crazy looking turtle guy over there. <laughs> Batting cages. I saw in here was actually like a skating rink. So that's kind of cool. But we're going to keep cruising around. Maybe end up in the mushroom garden over there. Who knows? But so far, we just chilling. It's totally the Pride Coaster Club of golf balls. They have every color of the rainbow. Oh, that's awesome. They have like a basketball court. There's another mini golf course. And I am headed over here to ride Leap the Dips. I saw maintenance up there, so I hope it's going. So should be going soon. But we're gonna go get on Leap the Dips because that just sounds awesome. This place is kind of legit in a way, like, it really is like a park. It's pretty cool. I'm into it. This is really cool. I found a gigantic chess set. <laughs> All the big pieces of it. This is pretty cool. Legitimately. Leap the dips quite isn't open yet, but someone from maintenance is here and they said it should be open today. So we're gonna go wander around and see what else there is to do here. Until then, we'll come back and check it out. This place is pretty cool though. Be a great park to have like a huge music festival there's all these like cool like areas you could have a stage and all these places you could have a picnic and stuff and here's the amazingness that has leaped the dips <laughs> so can't wait to ride this coaster this thing looks so awesome i love how it has a little like hut on the top of the hill up there seriously though this is a pretty cool park considering there's nobody really here yet but me <laughs> so legit beautiful day out today too it's not too hot it's like 55 so it's not gonna be too crazy just can't wait to go get on some dips a random little playground with a cool like wooden train it's a go-kart track over here sounds like anyway i think it's just the cars wanting to cruise around and we are gonna head over to the skyliner over there and go see if that's open yet and if not Maybe we'll go drive one of these old school cars around. Cause why not? <laughs> well, well, sorry, closed for maintenance. The Skyliner is also closed right now. I don't know, maybe this will open today, <laughs> maybe it won't. But either way, let's go cruise around. There's kind of like a baseball stadium back there next to Miranda McDonald sign. <laughs> She broke down on the track. <laughs> Skyliner isn't open, it's closed for maintenance. <laughs> That's okay. We'll see what happens with this today. <laughs> we'll hang out for a bit, because why not? I seriously hope I get to ride this today though. Well, riding the Skyliner does not look promising today because there's not even a train in the station. So don't think I'm gonna get on that today. <laughs> But they did say Leap the Dips should open today, so <laughs> let's just hope about that one because that will actually be my 400th coaster credit, guys. I came here today because I wanted Leap the Dips to be special for my number 400. They have batting cages here. That's legit. Let's see if this kid hits it. Oh, he missed it. There's a crazy cool little mini golf course over here. And I'm gonna wander around some more and see what else is here. Maybe I can find something that's uh, open. Maybe leave the dips will open soon. I can keep wishing, right? <laughs> Mini golf, the rabbit hole. Where's the rabbit? I don't see it. I see like a crazy little like castle thing made out of plants. Some trees that are being held up by sticks. A big bear head. <laughs> and a big basketball court. But let's keep on cruising. Let's see what else we can find around here. Well, here's the sign uh, that has the map and everything. Here's what's open today. It doesn't have Leap the Dips crossed off, so we're definitely going to try to get on that. But there's actually a good amount of stuff here. This is kind of cool. 
This is a cool sign. Leap the Dips Roller Coaster, built here in 1902 by E. Joy Morris of the Philadelphia. It was amongst the 250-foot slide fiction figure eight, figure eight roller coasters in North America. Become the last known ride of this type in the world, oldest known operating roller coaster, a national historical landmark. Here at Lake Mott Park. The Leap the Dips is totally going right now. So we made like a full lap around the park and we're gonna head over there and uh, go give it a ride. Right next to these cool batting cages right here. But let's head over to Leap the Dips and ride the oldest wooden roller coaster in the entire world. Love that. I just got off Leap the Dips. That's rougher than an old arrow. That is by far one of the roughest wooden coasters I've ever ridden. It was coaster credit number 400, so that is totally awesome, but a good ride. Super cool the way it runs, and there's no like restraints or seat belts or anything. You're just bumping. Super cool ride. Very, very cool ride. I think I'm gonna ride it again, even though just that beat me up pretty good. I don't ever say that, and I love old arrows. That was a fun ride. <laughs> There they go to the top of the hill, around the corner. Here they come. Keep on going, keep on going, keep on going. <laughs> That's seriously that ejector air time right there is so gnarly. So seriously, I just got off Leap the Dips again and I had a, I've ridden it four times, had a triple Zen ride in a row first time I rode it for my 400th credit was in the back row. That was so crazy rough. Had like gnarly ejector airtime, like gnarly, gnarly ejector airtime that I've never had that much ejector airtime on like a wooden coaster before. That is the most ejector airtime coaster that there is. That is super crazy fun. Like there's no seat belts, there's no lap bar. There's just like an oh shit bar in the front of it to grab onto. And that's pretty much it. And you're just charging. Like in the back, it's just gnarly. It beats you up worse than an old arrow or like the roughest wooden coaster you could imagine. The front though is actually pretty smooth and like a lot of fun. That is such a cool ride. Such a cool ride and such an awesome 400th credit. Like I'm so stoked right now. This, this is a cool park. Like that, that coaster alone, totally worth the trip to come up here, guys. Gotta come up to Lake Bot and ride Leap to Dips. It's one amazing wooden coaster for sure.
So I totally rode Leap the Ditch a couple of times, walked around the park, a good handful of times. Talked to some of their associates here who were all super cool and super nice. I got them to open the merch store for me so I can get a magnet to my, co my collection. And yeah, it's been a pretty cool day here at Lake Mont Park. So with that said, I'm gonna take off and uh, go on to the next adventure. Thank you guys for watching and uh, please be sure to like, comment and subscribe to the channel because you never know what crazy, awesome, fun place I will visit next or ride whatever roller coaster next. Love you guys, stay amazing, and I know you all will.